Hi Carpentry Addict, welcome again to your favorite woodworking and DIY channel and today I will talk you a little more about the WorkPro Mini Chainsaw This chainsaw is a small and light machine that allows us to move easily when working in the garden It uses a 12 volt battery that has a very good life working and has a perfect power for cutting small tree trunks and branches. It is also very useful for cutting thick branches when we are pruning smaller plants. That's why I consider it an important tool if you like gardening. Once we finish using our work for mini chainsaw, we have to maintain it, we have to clean it. Many times you will get entangled branches that will enter when the chain turns. To maintain our saw, first of all we have to remove the battery. We are going to take it apart by loosening this screw. We turn it so we'll be able to remove this piece. When removing this piece, we see that some particles of branches and sawdust enter it, that is perfectly normal. We are going to remove the chain and we are going to clean all this with a brush. It is very important to remove the sawdust particles and the small branches because they usually have moisture that is not suitable for the proper functioning of our saw. This will prolong the life of this equipment. Once this is done, we check the good condition of the saw chain. If we have to change it, it is very easy. We simply have to insert it into this slot. Remember that here you have a drawing that indicates the direction of rotation. We overlap it here. We put it through these slots. They must match these teeth. We put it this way. Once we have done this, we see that it is fully aligned and firm. We clean the lid because it may still have traces of sawdust and branches. We can use a blower if we have it at our disposal. We are going to match this screw to this hole that is right here. We proceed to tighten the screw again. By turning this piece we can adjust the tension of the chain. By raising this we can make our chain more or less tense, ok? First we press here and turn this until the tension is appropriate. When is it appropriate? When we have about 3 to 4 mm of space here, it doesn't have to be super tight. So we are ready to work again on the next garden job. In the description of this video I leave you the link to workprotools.store so you can see and buy these and other gardening tools. Thank you a lot for watching this video, remember to click on like, share and leave me your comment and don't forget to subscribe to my channel and I will see you in my next video.